Please welcome the lovely Sarah Rue, everybody. Sarah Rue. I'm sorry that we were... Wow, your legs look awesome. Oh, thanks. Last time I was here, you were staring at my boobs. Well, nice. We've changed it around yeah, a little bit. Yeah, it's good. So, um, Wolf Blitzer's funny, huh? Yeah. yeah. Well, the whole situation is just hilarious. He's hilarious. But, hey, no, I, no, I was going to ask you about shedding for the wedding. Is this okay. how to lose hair for a wedding? Is that what <laughs> it's it is? That's exactly what it's about. Really? No, it's nine couples losing weight and planning their weddings at the are, same are you, time. Are you, you look great. Have Thank you. Have you. you lost, you were yeah, Jenny Craig. Yeah, I'm the or? Jenny Craig, one of the Jenny Craig spokes people. Right. Um, I was last year. I was sort of on my weight loss journey, and now I'm just on maintenance, which oh, is nice. much more fun, by uh, the way. What weight loss journey did you take? You look great. Um, I took one where I weighed more and then I weighed less. Oh, that's the opposite. So it's like that journey. That's the opposite there. of the one I'm on uh, right now. <laughs> which is a lot of fun. I was on that one first. Uh, it's, yeah. it's so hard. It's, it really it is. is hard. It and, is hard. And are you getting married as well? Is I am. I'm no engaged way. to be married. Congratulations. Yes. Thank you. Right on, right on. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I didn't know. You didn't know? No, I didn't. I, oh. is there, I, who is the... Um, do, a man? A, a man. Okay. A man. Yeah. Uh, a manly, manly man. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. That's nice. He's, he's very uh, attractive, and uh, I'm lucky. Yeah. That, That's all I've got to so say. so is he. Yeah, I, no, where, he's where, good. Where did you meet him? We met at a party uh, playing beer pong. <laughs> I see. Yeah. And uh, I'm not good at beer pong, so he had to drive me home. Wow. And, you know, then that was that. Wow. Yeah. You I mean, not, oh, come on. Oh, come on. It wasn't like that. It was like that. No. It's okay, you're marrying him, so it's all right. That happened the next night. Really? Come on. I'm classy like that. No, yeah. come on. Do you still play beer pong with him? Yeah, we're going to have beer pong at our wedding. That's adorable. Isn't it? Charming yeah. and I'm classy. Not, I actually don't really know what that is, because when what? I was, no, when I was drinking, it, was, it wasn't a game. Oh. Game. Well, you were serious like, oh, about let's it. do something and then drink. Like, let's just. Ooh la la. Right. Yeah. Like, ooh, oh, right. you do this and then I'll drink something. How about you shut Tootsie Fruits? Oh, get me that drink. That's what drinking is. <laughs> that's what drinking is. That's right. Thank you. Thank you, audience, for endorsing my alcoholic lunacy. Blister got you all riled up. No, I love like, it here no, tonight. No, no, it's all right. So how do these people lose weight for the weddings then? Starve themselves? Uh, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, and really? working out. No, they're on a very sort of healthy nutritional plan, and it's a lot of working out. It's kind of like Biggest Loser meets all those wedding planning shows and rolled into one, and I host it. Do you uh, 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 do you do the bridezilla thing? Do you Are you getting ready for your own wedding? Are you yeah, but I'm not. I'm not. I'm really not a bridezilla. Uh, I'm really not. No, I'm not. I'm really not. Um, I'm really I don't not. know. You got red hair. Right there, you got a problem. Really? Oh, so? red-haired women! Come on, I've been around. I've met a couple of yeah. red-haired women in my life. Yeah, we're 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 sassy. <laughs> yeah, all right. Sassy is one way to put it. Yeah. Well. <laughs> you know, I, I, a little bit. You know, well, not necessarily. It's nothing to do with red hair. But you know, are you a very nitpicky person? Do you want a big detailed ceremony? You know, let's... no. I am exactly the opposite. Oh, okay. In fact, it, it, so much so that like I think my wedding planner is getting a little bit annoyed with me. She's like, you've got to make some decisions because like it's just not something I fantasized about as like a little girl. I wasn't one of those people that just thought, oh, and on my wedding day I'll have this and this and this. Like I, I don't care. I just want to have fun and be married and play some beer pong. It's, it's just that simple. Then let me ask you why you have a wedding planner. Right. Yeah. Huh. I mean, I'm, uh, I got married, admittedly, for the third time, but right. I got married uh, a couple of years ago and we didn't have a wedding planner. What? How, did you do it all yourself? You did it, right? Well, Picked everything out and planned Well, it. actually, what happened is when we turned up, there was a big snowstorm and we got stuck in the, uh, uh, the farm that we were at, so it was just whoever was there. And the Justice of the Peace had mm -hmm. snow tires. Because if the Justice of the Peace didn't have snow tires, I'd still be a single man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but she had snow tires and made it through, and that was it. And that's all we did. Really? And whatever we had to eat for the wedding feast was what was in the house. Okay, well, I'll tell you the truth. Right. The truth is this is my second uh, marriage. That's all right. You'll you catch up. Yeah. No. Uh, no. Oh, sorry. No, sorry. Come on. Right. No, I didn't mean that. I didn't I've mean that. I didn't what mean I that. 
having a hard time. I, I'm no. having planning this wedding. No. Please, this has to be the last one. Right. But I really want to do it right. You know, like I just sort of have this this feeling that I, I want to do sort of uh, traditional for us, which means not very traditional probably for the rest of the country. But for me, I just wanted it to be like a real wedding this time. Right. I wanted it to feel, um, you know, like the real deal. Right. I wanted to stand up in front of my my friends and my family. Are you, are you a religious person? Will oh, be in a church? God, no. Hey, no. hey, hey, hey. Oh. You don't say, are you a religious person? Oh, God, no. I mean, Why? doesn't that seem slightly ironic to you? Oh. It just seemed fair to ask. I mean, I you said know. like religion was somehow bad, and of course we know that's not true, CBS. <laughs> well, you've been saying uh -oh. all night. I oh. thought I could make It was so classy right up to yeah, there. Yeah, it really was, wasn't it? Wow, that's nice. Well, I'm delighted for you and your young gentleman. What does he do? Does he have Thank a job? Um, he does have a job. No way! Yeah. Score! Score! Uh-huh. Um, he has his own business. He helps kids get into college. He's an educational consultant. He's a teacher? Well, he does ACT, SAT. He helps them write their essays. He helps the parents with applications. He's like a one-stop shop for getting your kid into college. That's fantastic. It right? is. He's what very smart. What time does he start? Well, I got a nine-and-a-half-year-old. Is that too early? Um, call us in like three, four years. All right. All right. Yeah, no, that'd be a good idea. Although, I don't know if my... Are you going to have kids? Yeah, we'd like... I mean, we hope so. You know, if not, if it doesn't work out, we'll, we'll uh, you know, naturally, we'll adopt or right. whatever. Right, okay, yeah. We'll or go steal, you know, which <laughs> happens. What happened to you? Oh, I'm so embarrassing to you. Yeah. Jeez. Well, you, yeah, a little bit. You don't go around <laughs> stealing kids for just because you... Yeah, that's not right. All right. You'll have Nancy Grace in here. <laughs> that's just what you need. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a nice dress. Did you make that? Thank you, yeah. Bedazzled myself. D it, it, no. Did you really? No. I, I tell you, it's awesome. Thank you. What, is that bad? Is it wrong of me to say that? No, I mean, just it's who nice. makes their, what year are you living in where people are making their own dresses and coming on your show? <laughs> you know, I'm kind of living in the early 1950s, actually, now that you have. <laughs> where are you getting married? Just a state, just a general state. California. California. We are getting nice. married here. We're going to have the ocean as our backdrop to our well, wedding. Well, now we know where it's going to be. Yes. So, yeah, the, <laughs> it's be the beach? Uh, close to the beach, yes. Uh, the Overlooking the beach? A, a cliff? On a, maybe. On a cliff? Maybe on a cliff. Don't get married on a bluff. Why? Because bluff and vows, it's not a good mix. You see what I'm saying? Uh, okay. You know, good then you know. can say, did you really mean it at the time? No, I was bluffing. Oh. I'm going to miss you being single. <laughs> Do we have a clip, in, a clip of the show? We've got a clip of the show, so okay. we have to go, but we'll play a clip of the show if you want. Okay, that'd be good. I think you guys are going to like it. And CW still exists, and it's, it's thriving, actually. <laughs> just so you know. I just got, you know, a coat hanger on top of my TV, and I get CBS. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Sarah Rue, everybody. Sarah Rue, everybody. Sarah Rue. Lovely. I do. Yes, you do. You know, I was really pregnant in that clip. So you just have a new baby? I did. I had a baby and my vagina is ruined. <laughs> no, it's not. It just feels that way right now. Yeah. You know, you know in Return to the Jedi when they're leaving at the beginning of the movie and they're on that hovercraft over the desert and then there's that giant pit with that giant hole with all those teeth? That's what yes. I that's kind of what I imagine it looks like. Well, you see, you've probably never seen it from the perspective of actually, I, I have watched right. two of my children, and I only have two, I've watched them both. Uh -huh. <laughs> that's good. I've watched them both, uh, and it's a beautiful thing. Yeah, no, actually, I did see it happening. I saw it happening. Really, what, I you had, had a mirror or something? I had, well, I wasn't holding it, you know, they right. reeled it in, yeah. Really, so you watched the I watched the whole thing, well, because when I got in there, I was like, what do you see? Is she coming out? Is there hair? Like, I was asking so many questions, the nurse was like, oh my God, I'm getting the mirror. Like, she was so over me. They have the mirror? The mirror. Right. So they wheeled in this mirror and they they lined it up and I I watched the whole thing. Wow. Yeah. And 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 how long ago was this? Uh, three months, exactly three months. I would never have guessed. Oh, come on. You're just being nice. I'm just thinking about you're probably still breastfeeding a bit, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. A little 
little bit. Do you know what, though? That, are you enjoying it? That's the thing. Are you enjoying all of that breastfeeding business and everything? I am. I really am, actually. Because I'm loving it right now, <laughs> Thank right? You so much. No, it's getting a little, like my husband tonight, I was like, I don't know what I'm going to talk about. I'm just, I've been a mom, you know, I've just been home being a mom. I'm so boring now. And he was like, why don't you just talk about your breasts? They are huge. <laughs> I was like, thank you, honey. And thank you, Secretariat. I like looking over my shoulder and just seeing this. Yeah. <laughs> you guys know each other? Well, you know, I did, I did, um, okay. I did uh, spend my summers in Lexington, Kentucky. And so you did? I, I, I'm familiar with, you know, Secretariat and horses. And well, yeah, well, so that uh, do you ride horses? Um, I did when I, when I was well, younger. Well, not right not now. now. No. Not, well, oh, no. It's not the fact that your breasts are large. There are large-breasted women ride horses all the time. I know that for a fact. But they, uh, <laughs> but it's more about you've got the baby. You're busy. You're you know, I am. No sleep, right? Well, actually, I mean, people hate me for this. She's sleeping through the night pretty much. She, pretty much. She's yeah, yeah, I hate you for that. Yeah, I yeah. know. I know. How does that happen? Is, was, is she a particularly she, docile, nice baby? A, we got so lucky. And I think, you know, when people say, well, God gives you what you can handle, which is totally a That's backhanded compliment rubbish. because yeah, yeah, she's so yeah, yeah. easy and yeah. lovely. But I think she got my husband's disposition. So she's been like... So your husband's a good-natured gentleman? He is so even and nice and like, he sleeps through the night, which is good. Um, <laughs> That's pretty impressive. Yeah. I don't sleep through the night. I mean, baby or no baby, I don't sleep through really? the night. Really? You don't? No, no, no. Do you? Not really. You just no. so much on your mind. You well, know? that, and when I was a kid, I used to deliver milk. I'd have to go up at half past four to deliver milk for a minute at school. I still wake up every morning to deliver the milk. Every do you really? Morning. Every morning. So do I. That's yeah. funny. Well, yeah, different thing, but yeah. <laughs> Same kind of thing? Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's funny that. I haven't thought about that milk round in years, and then I just talked to you. <laughs> How in my head. Bizarre, bizarre. Oh, that's lovely. But it's, <laughs> I mean, it's nice that you're enjoying it. It's nice. This is a very special time, and it gets easier. I, you know what? It's, I mean, yeah. It's really easy. It's been wonderful. Like every. How could that be? That's messing with my mind. I, I don't know if so many people gave us such horror stories that I was then so nervous going into right, it that right, now I'm like, true. wait a minute, this is a piece of cake. But she has been just right now. We are getting. I think on. girls are more trouble later on though when they get that's to what teenagers says. and stuff. Yeah, teenagers yeah. and they're they're mean and they don't speak to you for years but for yeah, now yeah. She's, she's been really really great but no like, what you, you like teenage girls aren't like that they're like that they are i was I mean, yeah I, yeah i was too and yeah. i know i'm gonna <laughs> You know, I was frightened of teenage girls. Were you a mean teenage girl? No, no, no. I was the victim. Oh, were you? Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, see? oh my God. No, yeah. and I'm still to this day scared of teenagers, as a general rule. Well, I'm, I I'm certainly. I'm not joking. Like it's not. Ha ha. I'm like dead serious. I'm scared. Well, of you're teenagers. scared of them, like some people that are afraid of spiders. Like if you see one, you're like, get it out, get it out, get it out. <laughs> um, I'm scared. Like if I see a group of them, I'll cross the street. Well, that's only wise. Right. I, I am. Um, if I see teenagers on my lawn, I get very upset. Well, yeah. I mean, like, get, get off of there. But I try to say it not in an old man way. So how do you say it? Please, get off my lawn. <laughs> or I tweet, get off my lawn, That's hashtag. Good. That's good. You know who I mean. That's yeah. good. I like that. The thing is, though. Are you on Tweety? Are you on the Twitter? How come, wait, you don't follow me on Twitter? Oh, yeah, I do. Of course I do. I'm sorry, uh -huh. I forgot. Um, but the, uh, that's not for teenagers anymore. No? What, it, what Well, it can't be if I'm doing it. Oh, no. You know. Well, I think they just do it in a different way. Actually, I'm, I know that you don't follow me on Twitter because you wouldn't have that mug on your desk if you did. <laughs> Want to know why? Why? Because there was a giant rattlesnake in my pool today. Really? Yeah. No joke. Oh. And guess what? They swim. <laughs> I, it was honestly, it was pretty traumatic, I have to say. For the snake, too, I'm sure. I mean, well, uh, yeah. It's but I think yeah. rattlesnakes are the fairest of all snakes. How so? Well, they say, I'm right here, I'm rattling, yeah. keep away from me. It's no, like, I don't like the snakes without rattles who are like, hey, what's up? You know, <laughs> rattlesnakes are like, I'm a snake. If you don't like snakes, right. you're not going to like me. Right. So, ah. Yeah, yeah no, that's you know, true. Yeah. But in a pool, they can't rattle. Ah. So it's just that slithery eel like and they can Did swim. Did you get the net thing and go to get out? Okay, well, well to be perfectly honest, this is the second time this has happened and the first time Same snake? No. Oh, okay. Well actually it could be. Not anymore, unfortunately, because but we didn't do it. We called animal control because I didn't we have a new baby and I didn't want my husband of course, out absolutely. with a stick in the net. Like, it just seems like yeah. for her to lose her dad at such a young age. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. seem right. No, absolutely. Later on, it'll be all right. But um, so the first time the first time he went out with the thing and threw it over our fence and we back up to a, a park. Um, but this time we called animal control. 
I, I quite like snakes. Like a playground. Actually. Oh, they're thinking like a playground. Like I threw the oh, snake. Oh, like they threw the snake no, at other people's like children. A... Oh, no. Oh, my God. No, Listen, like in the wilderness. Like you should, wild. Have been, you should have been here earlier. They were laughing at murder. <laughs> That's not right. It's not, not right. right. We have not to take a break. We'll be okay. right back with Sarah. Right, right. pair of hands. Yeah, yeah. Welcome back, everybody. I'm here with Sarah. Uh, we were just chatting about, mm -hmm. you know, snakes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. Throwing them into uh, parks. <laughs> like, like wilderness parks. Wilderness like, parks. There's no yeah. children out there. Let's just be clear. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you upset a lot of people. I know. Yeah. I always, you know, people always get upset after I come on your show. Really? What? Yeah, because I think people sort of expect me just with the characters I play or something to just be like. <laughs> You know, like, yeah, yeah. like super cheery and lovely, and I'm well, not. You are super not cheery really, and lovely. Not really. You've got a. You've got a. You I've know, got a dark a, side. You've got a darkness. Yeah. But that that that's authentic. You have to have that. If you walked around being chipper and lovely all the time, you'd be like someone in a sitcom. <laughs> Wait a minute. <meaner. laughs> We're out of time. All right. <laughs> Man, you, you were actually quite hostile there when I said we were at time. You were like, all right. Well, like, you were so defensive about it. No, I'm I wasn't like, defensive okay about it. it. You know, I was just trying to, you know, be honest about my feelings. Well, I have to go anyway. So. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, oh, where'd you have to go to? I have to catch a plane. Why is it in your pool? <laughs> You know, I actually do have a crush on is uh, Beth, the executive. That <laughs> I, honestly, no, Beth. I think you do a great job. I think it's tough out here. You know, no, I, I know I fool around a little bit and stuff, but I would so do you. 